Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to solve the last part of question number five. In this case, you have to subtract this expression from this expression. So before subtraction, what we have to do is we have to simplify both these expressions. Means we have to first of all open the bracket, and after that we can further solve this. Now let's solve this. Uh, the first thing to open this bracket, you have to multiply this three a with all the terms so you have to multiply this with a as well as b as well as with c so 3a multiplied by a will give 3a square because we know that when the base is same the power is added and if there is no mention of power we consider it as 1 so 3a plus uh, 3a multiplied by a will be 3a square similarly 3a will be multiplied with 3 uh, With b, so this will give 3ab, and at the last 3ac. Now we have to multiply this with this to open this bracket. So we have to multiply with all three terms, and there is a negative sign outside the bracket. So inside the bracket, all the sign will be changed. Now 2a multiplied by plus a will give minus 2ab, and this will give positive. 2b multiplied by b will be 2b square. Again, the base is same, so the power will be added. And at the last, this will give negative 2bc. And we have to subtract this from this expression. So let's solve this also. For that, we have to multiply 4c with all three terms. So 4c will multiplied by a will give 4ac with negative sign. And this will be 4cb. And this will be 4c square. Again, the base is same. The power will be added. Now, before subtraction, we can for, uh, let's check whether there are like terms so that we can solve them further. So 3a square will be as it is because there is no like term to this. But 3ab and this ab are like terms, so these can be solved. So plus minus is minus. So 3 minus 2 is 1. So this will give. 1 ab. So there is no need to write 1 because if there is nothing written, this is considered as 1, and the sign will be positive because greater value has positive sign. Now this 3 ac will remain as it is because there is no like terms to this. This we have already already solved. This can be written here, and the last one will be written here, and this has to be subtracted from minus 4 ac. Plus 4cb plus 4c square. Again, I have told you that there are two ways of solving this. The first, you can write these horizontally, or the second, you can write this vertically. So let's solve the first case. I have already told when you have when you have to subtract this from this, so it's better to write this at the first. So this is minus 4ac plus 4cb. Plus 4c square, and after that you have to subtract this from this, so you have to write this below this. So it's better to write the like terms below like terms. So this is 3a square will be written as it, because there is no like terms to this, so I have written this separate. And this ab will be written before uh, there is no ab, so this ab will be written separately. Can be written separately. This AC will be written below. This AC, again, this plus two B square will remain as it is. Uh, this will be remain. Uh, this we have to write separately. And at the last, we have to write BC. So this is the BC. So we have to write minus two BC below BC. And now let's count. This is one, two, three, four, five. And we, uh, whether we have written the four terms or not, one, two, three, four, five. So five terms are already written. Now we have to subtract. So we have to change the signs. So this positive will become negative. Positive will become negative. This will become positive. This will become negative, and this will become negative. So there is no uh, uh, there is no term to solve with this. So this will remain as it is. These can be solved. Okay, this is negative. Again, this has become negative. So negative, negative is positive. So four plus three is seven, 
with negative sign because greater value has negative sign. Again, this is plus plus plus. So four plus two is six with positive sign because greater value has positive sign. So this four AC will remain as four C square will remain as it is because there is uh, no other term to solve with this. And this negative two B square and negative AB will remain as it is because these are again single terms. And this is important as now this change has. This sign has changed into negative, so you have to write negative here. So this is the answer. Okay, now let's uh, write this horizontally. We know that we have to subtract this from this. For first of all, we have to write this. So four AC plus four CB plus four C square. Now we have to subtract. So this is the first bracket, and subtract the second, which is three A square plus AB. Plus three AC plus two B square, and at the last minus two BC. So this will remain as it is. Now this is negative sign outside the bracket, so we have to change all the sign inside the bracket. So that is why in this, when we are subtracting this from this. Because there is a negative sign outside the bracket, so we have to change all the signs. So the new signs will be of opposite nature. So this can be solved. This will become minus three a square. This will become minus a b minus a c minus two b square and plus two b c. Now to further solve this, we have to see the like terms. Now this is minus four a c. And in this complete term, here we found minus of uh, AC. So these two can be solved together. So minus four AC and the second one minus three AC can be written together. This is second term, which is four CB. And here we find CB. So these can be solved together. And this is my plus. 4c square. So this will remain as it is because there is no like terms to this to solve this uh, to solve with this. And minus 3a square again will remain as it is. AB we have on uh, AB we haven't written yet. So AB will be written here. This AC we have written here, and this 2b square will be written. As it is now, let's solve this negative. Negative is plus, so minus minus is plus. So four plus seven, uh, three is seven. The negative sign. This is minus seven AC because greater value has negative sign. So this will become plus. So this will become six CB. This is same C multiplied by B or B multiplied by same C will be. Uh, these are two same things. So this will be uh, this will be six CB. Plus four c square will remain as it is. Minus three a square will remain as it is. Minus a b and minus two b square will remain as it is. So the answer will be same. But this minus three a b a square uh, this is written here, and minus seven a c is written here. Six a b c is written here. Minus four c square is written here. Ah. Uh, Sorry, ah, uh, this is plus four c square because this value was plus four c square minus two b square is written here, and at the last minus a b is written here. So in the both the cases, the answer is same, but it it is written ah uh, not in symmetry. So this is how we can solve this part also. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel, and you can contact us. The phone number and the email address is given below in the description. Thank you.